And a question that many people are asking tonight, what will happen to Fiesta this year? Old Spanish Days usually unveils its pin and poster this week. Fox 11's Tracy Lair has an update from the organizers of the 96th Fiesta celebration. Thousands of people lined Cabrillo Boulevard and State Street to enjoy El Desfile Historico each year. Others watch it on TV. The Old Spanish Days Historical Parade is known as one of the largest horse parades in the country. And when it happens, these stables at the Earl Warren Showgrounds in Santa Barbara are full. We have ridden in the Santa Barbara Fiesta Parade for many years and are very honored and proud to do so. This is a fabulous parade. The Ventura County Sheriff's Posse Parade Chairman was pleased to see a posse picture on the SBFiesta.org website, but she couldn't sign up or pay the fee like she had in the past. A lot of difficulty getting communication from anyone in charge of the parade. I am certainly hoping we can rectify that situation. So we reached out to this year's El Presidente. This is Eric Davis, El Presidente of Old Spanish Days Fiesta 2020. We've been monitoring the situation around coronavirus for two months now. He says safety is key. And Fiesta's gonna look different. The situation's different for us all. We're gonna have more details after our board meeting next week. But at the very least, we hope to be able to provide a little bit of hope and joy and optimism, however that looks. In the spirit of Viva La Fiesta, the nonprofit's board members plan to meet next week and they are welcoming donations. You'll find a link on our website at myfox11.com. In Santa Barbara, Tracy Lair, Fox 11 News.